Welcome back to Relaxing Reality, and today is August 4th, 2024. It is night two, day two, of the Metallica M72 Tour, Foxborough, Massachusetts, Gillette Stadium. Back with the family again for an amazing part two of this epic weekend. There's lightning at the Metallica concert. There's a policy where if there's a lightning strike or a thunder, they have to wait 20 minutes for it to clear. And every every 10 minutes we get a lightning strike. So a lot of people are getting anxious. It is 7.34 and we'll see if this happens. <laughs> you just need to pump in, ride the lightning over the PA system. All fans now return to the ah! going on down on the ground level. People are running. People are running. We don't have to run because we have sign seats. Oh, and on, everyone. <laughs> yeah. APM! No, no repeat. No repeat weekend. And we're excited to take you along with us. And we invite you to rock and relax your reality with us. Metallica! Yeah! All right, we made it. Time is two o'clock, and we are in a parking lot just outside of Papa Gino's. And we're about 0.3 miles away from the stadium. We have our escape plan ready and prepared after the disaster from Friday night where we didn't even get a chance to leave until what? 1.30 in the morning? Yeah. We got the chance to leave the parking lot? Flashback. We're gonna be here a while. It's 12 o'clock and we're stuck in our car. And yeah, but it was a lot of fun. One hour later. More than point three miles, though. It's uh, more almost a mile, but hey, it'll be are. worth the. It says it's a fifteen-minute walk. They did not even let three-quarter mile the general parking parking lot leave until like one thirty-five in the morning. By the time we got out and on the road, it was like one forty-five in the morning, and it was mm -hmm. absolutely crazy. So it was forty dollars. Forty dollars. Forty dollars to park here, Cash. and. Uh, they gave us a ticket and put it in the dashboard and we decided it was worth it yeah. because waiting it was like almost three hours after the concert ended that we finally got out of the parking lot yeah we that have to drive insane. back to connecticut tonight so a little bit of a drive afterwards we should get home at a reasonable time as opposed to you know yeah. <laughs> who knows when so let's go get some pizza because papa gino's pizza so papa gino's pizza for the win yep yeah, there's a little lot right here and they are gonna probably fill this up but the nice thing is when we get out tonight we can take a right right here and then go the back road and we are out of the way we don't even have to touch route one and there's porta potties right here so that's nice yay we're gonna we're gonna exit out this way tonight right, time is 206 and uh, the lot was pretty much empty, so we were able to snag a spot. I would imagine that's probably gonna fill up. We'll let you know what time after we're done eating, if the lot's full or not. I grew up in Massachusetts. Papa Gino's is uh, the pizzeria place I love. And we've eaten here a couple times in the past. It's great to stop on by here and park here. This is my favorite pizza place. It's like your birthday dinner. Before it, your birthday. Like Birthday lunch, kind of. Before your birthday. So, we parked. We're here. Hopefully, it'll be easier getting out. Papa Gino's. All right. This is it. I've missed this place so, so much. So good. So good. It's I don't a, think I've ever had Papa Gino's. A pre Metallica pizza at Real Papa Gino's. Real pizza right here. Real pizza. <laughs> 12 seconds later. Just like that, it's gone. It's good. How was your birthday pizza? Yeah, it was really good. Yeah. I miss this place. Yeah. Next time we come here, we're going to get Absolutely. Mm. Almost three o'clock and the lot is pretty much full and people are tailgating, believe it or not, in the lot outside of Papa Gino's. Yeah, it's almost like a private, private tailgate event over here. People got their canopy set up. Just chilling out, waiting for 
the stadium to open. At four o'clock is when I let people in. Sub, Metallica music, AC, and it just took a little nap. All right, 4.32, we'll see how long it takes us to walk over to the stadium from here. I'm gonna walk this way. And there's other lots over here, so it wasn't just our lot that was uh, open to parking. Yeah, it's like, what, it was like 95 degrees on Friday, and it's yeah. like, whew, makes a huge difference. About a 21 minute walk or so. Not that bad. <laughs> There's the rain. sitting way 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 up there way up there is our seat all right this is where we say goodbye for now we're gonna go up top we're gonna walk around here we go Passing these out again tonight. Chance to win a signed vinyl. You get the QR code and scan it. And the rain is really coming down right now. This is uh, definitely getting everything soaking wet. Some dedicated people waiting in line for some merchandise. Section 326, row four, nine and 10. Just like we left it, right? <laughs> yeah. I'm back, buddy. Yep. Oh, wait, no, this one. Yep. I'm back, buddy. We may get lucky with the rain. The forecast shows for scattered showers, but they may be north and south of us, so we'll see what happens. I'll punch it up just in case. It's significantly cooler than it was two days uh, on Friday night, so. Yep. Yeah. They just turn off all the screens, which means it's going to be starting soon. And the first band is Ice Nine Kills. They're a Boston heavy metal crazy band out of Boston here. Death metal. Death horror metal band. horror band. Uh, never heard of them until uh, tonight, so we're going to check them out.
advising everyone to go in the concourse now because it is inclement weather. There's lightning at the Metallica concert. We know it's raining, but here we go. <laughs> Inside the stadium concourse a <laughs> little bit of a rain delay, storm delay. Yeah, now they're letting people in and everyone's like running and it's uh, kind of a free for all. I don't know what they're doing. And she smoked inside the stadium concourse immediately. There was a, a mass of people come running out, and now they're telling them to get back. inside the stadium concourse, the area. Please pay close attention to the events that will be you just need to pump in ride the lightning over the PA system Oh my gosh, yeah, this is why we're staying here. Are you live or something? No, it's not like you think about that vlog it later on. It's not very clear. Here, here we go. There we go, yeah, look at that. Yeah, there's a policy where if there's a lightning strike or a thunder, they have to wait 20 minutes for it to clear. And every, every 10 minutes we get a lightning strike. So right now it's just uh, in a holding pattern. Everyone's just kind of waiting. You got people down here that are just waiting to, to get back on the floor. And uh, a lot of people are getting anxious. It is 7.34 and we'll see if this happens. Uh, there's also a, a strict curfew at 11 o'clock. They have to noise ordinance here that you can't be past 11 and having a concert here in Foxborough. So there's that as well. People. Oh, they. <laughs> People are chanting. They're like, let us in. Yeah. Oh, I'm in the vlog. What's yeah. up, vlog? Wait, 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 are we going now, or is it is it Everybody's over? Everybody's going. Metallica time. Stop. Yeah, baby. Woo! Here we go, Metallica. Oh. I never thought I'd be so happy to see the rain and not thunder. Here we are. We're done again. Yeah! We survived. And lightning delay. Woo Woo! Yeah, people are cheering as the staff is coming back out. Yeah, we just sat down and then a lightning bolt came right over the top of the lighthouse over there. And now we have to go back undercover. And that's where we are right now, just waiting for this storm to pass us, hopefully. All fans may now return to your seat. Yeah! 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 8 p.m. they're going to start. going on down on the ground level people are running people are running we don't have to run because we have to see sign seats <laughs> you're just like you know what it's yeah it's a concert you're gonna get wet it's okay we're gonna have a good time if T-Swift can do it Metallica can do it 
nastiness will be behind us here. They turn back on the regular displays. The weather advisory has been lifted. It's a little wet, but we're still here. Survived the lightning delay. That was crazy. We found seats. Yeah, we were just sitting on a bench down there. Yeah, we were just up here. We, we sat down, we went in, we, we had to go back, we sat down again. Yeah, they just announced that Ice Nine Kills is not going to perform tonight. Um, hopefully, Five Finger Death Punch will be able to do a shortened set. Let's see what happens here.
I think we dodged the bullet, at least for Metallica's portion, which is obviously the main reason why we're here. The, the rain uh, has finally passed us now, so it's uh, moving off to the, the southeast, and we should be good the rest of the night. Uh, took the ponchos off. My hair is soaked. We're ready for Metallica night two, finally. Almost got canceled. Almost got canceled. It was pretty dicey there, but they powered through the storms, and now we are ready. We're ready. 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 Woohoo! Metallica! Metallica! Friday night, they had a wave going when everyone had their flashlights out. It was on their phones. It was pretty cool. Let's see if they can actually... I don't even know if they're going to replicate that. That would be fun if they do that again, though. They're starting to. Yay! shot of us waiting almost got canceled tonight that was crazy very very like 50 50 but it pulled through yep. now we're good now it's metallica time Woo!
of the Talica family take over of Boston. We hope you're having fun this weekend, as we most certainly are. Here's a song that uh, is off one of the albums. I always forget which one it is. You, you know better than I.
They're going to entertain you for a little bit. And have fun. Kirk and I like to have a jam. So this song is really scary, super heavy, and if you start moshing, try not to injure yourself because it is such a scary song and I'm already shaking. Anyway, Kirk, you ready to start this thing off? One, two.
For you, Cliff, we miss you, brother. is so blessed, I tell you. We're like, we're like 150 years old and we're still up here because you're here! We don't want to let the Metallica family down, man. We keep going and going. All right, here's a song that, uh, it's a little bit long and I hope you can put up with it. You already know what it is, right? Do you like it? You love this song? You wouldn't lie to me, right? Okay. It's this guy's favorite song, right? Go on. He didn't say favorite. He loves it. Alright. This one's for you.
Dude, that was awesome. They played Inamorata, which is the longest Metallica song. They, they only played, played that once in Germany. That was so cool. They had all the pyrotechnics on night two. And it did not rain the entire rest of the night. It was awesome. I love how the, the pyrotechnics for the explosions go Happy birthday, James! <laughs> Man, so much for the 11 o'clock curfew. We blew past that. 11.22. Oh it's the part of the concert where it looks like they're feeding fish. <laughs> He's taking selfies. Yeah, he's taking selfies with the camera. <laughs> That's amazing. Did you expect them to play Neil Diamond no. at a Metallica concert? Oh, that was great. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. We can't rely on With a bass and electric guitar. That was awesome. So did you like the second night yeah. as well? I liked it better than the first night. Yeah. What was your favorite part? I mean, Under Sandman was pretty cool, but The Unforgiven was also really good. We were going to say Sweet Caroline. That was also really fun. <laughs> that, was, that, was, that was pretty epic. It was unexpected, but good. <laughs> did, did you like the first night or the second night? Second night better. Yeah? They, played, the... they played a bunch of songs. They put, well, I mean, we we saw the first night at MetLife Stadium. Well, I wanted to hear Blackens. So. Last year, Blackens, one of your favorite songs. They played Inamorata. They played... Which I haven't played. 
it was cool to see them use the pyrotechnics with one and moth into flame i love every second of it my so. dream was to see one live because i knew that they had explosion pyrotechnics ever since you told me and showed me a, a crappy video from uh 2018 but not no not 2008 2008. 2009 2009 from when you went to Death Night Egg and it was crappy video quality because the phone sucked back then <laughs> and but it's still you can see the pyrotechnics it was pretty cool. Awesome. I'm gonna hand it off to you. Uh, see ya. It was a lot of fun. Well that's gonna do it for tonight for this weekend. Another amazing concert. So grateful that we got to see two Metallica concerts in a one weekend and the weather held off. We were able to get through the storms, and uh, yeah. They're already dismantling the stage. <laughs> they are. If you're new to the channel, like and subscribe. We really appreciate your support. We go to a lot of uh, adventures. We go to theme parks. Uh, we just have a lot of fun with our family. So if you're new to the channel, uh, like, subscribe, uh, share this video. Um, we'll link to other Metallica concerts that we've been to. This is now the third one that we've been to as a family. So yeah, thanks for relaxing reality with us. We'll see you on the next adventure. All right, bonus scene here. We're going to see how long it takes us to get out of Foxborough. It is. It is 11.41 right now. We are... We're one of the last. We did play a little bit. Oh, right. so yeah. yeah, I know. It's 11:41. We're leaving the stadium now, and uh, I'll check in when we get to our car. A few moments later. All right. Walking for about 34 minutes, but we also walked around the stadium, made it to the lot here, and the side street. You can't really turn down it, but you can turn down it from this parking lot, so we're gonna be able to avoid Route 1 and get out before 12.30. How's that? All right, so it's uh, we're gonna get home at two o'clock and uh, we're, look at this, no, no traffic. We get to like actually just leave, which is awesome compared we're to the other night. We're gonna get back at the time that we left yesterday. So we got out of the parking lot yesterday. Yep. Oh, all right. Now, we're going to end the vlog.